Hello, in this video, I'm just going to quickly show two examples of how you can set up your monitor and your World of Warcraft windows for multiboxing this great game. So, in this first setup, I have a five man multiboxing group of a druid tank, mage, fury warrior, warlock, priest. The big screen is the tank. As more often than not, the tank is kind of the one that runs the show. The tank is the one that controls events that occur in the game. And so that's generally the screen that screen that you want to be the biggest. Um, I have a, at a what four to three-ish aspect ratio, give or take. Of course, you can make the window larger or bigger, however you see fit. And I have my slave characters to the right of it. So big screen is the tank. That's the one you're focused, primarily focused on. The other characters are kind of on a smaller window to the side uh, you can still click on their skills ideally you you know you're going to have everything hotkey to say one through ten and f1 through f whatever but you can still click on their skills and you can still control them however you need but they're not really running the show the main focus is running the show and i've seen a few people who have their setups where they have their main screen like their tank or whatever in a very elongated rectangular screen, like a wide screen, and then they have their slave characters across the bottom. Uh, I'm not a fan of it, but you can choose how to do this. This is an example of a one monitor multi boxing setup. Now, if you have two or more monitors, which are very helpful with regards to multi boxing, here's an example of how you can set those up. So my example I'm going to show you now is just a two monitor setup. So say these are my two monitors. I personally have three, but these are my two monitors. Um, I would make one monitor into a tank monitor or the main character monitor. So in this case, this would be the tank. He runs the show and he would be filling up one of my monitors. Um, Again, for the same reasons, the tank runs the show, tank does things, that's generally where your primary primary focus is. Now, on the second monitor, I would have my slave characters set up. So in this case, it would be, what is it, a rogue, shaman, and two hunters. So, and that would be my setup if, say, I was using two monitors and five boxing. Now... If you're only three boxing, two boxing, whatever, you can change the window size. You can adjust however you see fit. These are simply two examples I'm showing on how to just set up your screens so as to maybe best multi-box. Now this may not be the best user interface. If you see improvements, feel free to let me know because my user interfaces tend to be kind of ugly. They're not the cleanest, I know. And I've seen some people with very clean user interfaces. I just haven't gone into making mine clean. Either way, these are examples, and they do work. This works just fine for me, and hopefully it could help get you started. Uh, if anybody knows of any improvements or have any questions, feel free to write those down in the comments below. Part of my reason for doing these videos is to find how other people do their multiboxing and maybe learn a thing or two from them as I do mine. So again, just gonna quickly recap. Two monitor setup, you can have like a tank, and then you could have, say, your other four, three, two, one characters on the other monitor. And if you have, say, a one monitor setup, you can just have it set up like this, where you have a tank, or whatever your lead character is, as the big screen, the big monitor, the big image, and then you could have your four slave characters kind of to the side or below, um, however you see fit. Take care. Happy multiboxing.